Hello, 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 everyone, and welcome back to Tooth and Scrubs Gaming. Thank you so much for joining me here today in Mini Metro. We're going to be checking out London in the 1960s. Let's get on back to the Austin Power eras. We're going to dial back the clock and revisit London's underground in the 60s. Let's go ahead and click play here, hop on in, and let's see what happens here in this new map. Ooh, I like the I like the art style. We'll go ahead and get our subway ri line running, not Ryan. Uh, I'm going to have it actually do this, and then we're going to do, yeah, I know, do that. We'll use our two lines to start. Got a circle spawning over there, so we'll have the red line pick that up so it has everything on its line. Let's go ahead and jump to double speed here. If you've never watched any of my mini Metro videos, I highly recommend you go back and check them out now. Uh, if you don't want to, let me give you a quick rundown of the game. It's a pretty straightforward game. Uh, you connect the shapes together and your goal is to move the shapes to the sh shape that they correspond to. So circles to circles, squares to squares. If you let too many people build up at the station, uh, it'll start to chirp at you and then eventually you will lose and you don't want to lose. You try to avoid having what I just did where you have a lot of the same shapes on the line uh, or on the same line. So that's a bad idea, but at least we have that square there to break up that double circle. We're about to put three triangles in a row on the red line. Uh, again, not ideal, but this early in the game, that's what I'm going to do. Eventually, we'll use our yellow line and these other four lines we have down here that will unlock, unlock to, um, to spread the love, if you will. Um, good news is with that circle down there, that should help out. Um, do I want more tunnels? No, we'll take an additional line here. Uh, with that additional line, I think what we're going to do is something like this. And then we're going to back, well, no, we'll leave the red line like that. We're going to start to zoom out here a little bit, it looks like. And that will show us more of the map. Uh, and with that circle spawning, we're going to actually do that. Now, if we were playing on the hardcore mode, we wouldn't be able to move our lines around like that. But uh, since we're playing on the normal mode, it allows me to cheat a little bit like that. And it looks like our first special shape has spawned in there on the northwest corner, that plus sign right there. Uh, our red line will be solely responsible for moving those pluses there. Brown line's going to have three circles. Not ideal. I wish we had a triangle in there for the brown line to go to. But uh, that's what it is right now, and that's what it will be. As we cross 75 people here in the 1960s London, uh, we've got a square up there. Um, we could do something like this. There we go. We'll get that yellow line going all the way up to that square. Uh, and there's another circle down there, that brown line, not exactly what I want it to have to do here. Let's go ahead and get the locomotive, and we'll definitely take the interchange here. That's an easy pick. Um, let's pause for a second here, and I think what I want to do is this to this to maybe like this. That green line can kind of help out. Got a circle spotting over there, excuse me. Red line will help there. Since we've got such a long red line, let's go ahead and get that extra train on the red line. Uh, and since it has to carry all those special shapes, I want to give it uh, a little extra help here. Yellow line will reach out, hit that triangle there. See, it's a good pattern there. We got triangle, circle, triangle at the east end of the yellow line. So we can't complain too much about that. As we roll here into about 141 people moved, uh, let me know down below in the comments what's going on in your guys' life. You guys know I like to hear about that. Uh, today is uh, Saturday, March 2nd, 2024. Uh, as I record this, we're going to get the green line all the way up there. Uh, so yeah, let me know what's going on. I'd love to hear from you guys. What's going on in your life? Uh, what games you're playing? Big plans as spring rolls around? Yeah, anything like that I would uh, appreciate hearing as this green line train blows by that station to go pick more people up. That is nice. 189 people moved here. The week's almost over with. We'll get ourselves a little more prizes here to work with. Uh, we'll take the locomotive and we'll go ahead and take, we're going to take that extra line. Um, we'll go ahead and drop the yellow line down to that circle. Again, not ideal to have that double back-to-back -back circle, but that's okay. Um, we'll have the green line run out and hit that circle there. And you know what? Let's have the red line go there as well. Uh, we might have to put an interchange on that square. Um, yellow line can grab that square there, but luckily our other trains were able to prevent that from happening. We still have this magenta purple line we can use here, uh, but we'll hang on to that, I think, for a few minutes. 
Let's see what happens there. Okay, that was able to capture a few things. We don't have to worry about that. Brown line and green line circle from chirping at us. Um, let's get this triangle here. Man, there's a lot of things chirping at us down here. Okay, they seem to have figured that out. All right, that's not as bad. Man, yellow line. Let's get another train on the yellow line, shall we? It's a long line. Uh, let's get that moving there as we're about halfway through Sunday. 332 people moved here. Got a pentagon out there. With that, what I think we'll do is let's go ahead and get the interchange. I'm going to take this new purple magenta line, whatever it is, and it's going to come out. It's going to hit here. It's going to hit here, there, to this triangle, to maybe this square. Yeah, let's do something like that. There we go. That way it hits quite a few things. It can help out here and there. Uh, it can hopefully grab some of these triangles that the brown line are bringing in. That station down there in the southwest quadrant. Ooh, red line's gonna have double the work there with that diamond there now. Um, a lot of triangles are getting dropped off there. I'd really like to find a, a triangle station for this brown line to go to. Um, I really hope we get something that either spawns south of the river or I might have it go across um that triangle there let's get the purple line and the green line up there man this station over here is spawning quite a bit too uh another circle up there since the yellow line does have two trains we'll have it hit that circle there um and since it does pass pretty closely let's get it into that station there we're cruising right along 400 and what are we at 80 people moved I guess I could have the yellow line hop across there to grab that circle there. Man, I might have to drop. This yellow line's got to do a lot of work. All right, new week here. Um, let's take a train and a carriage. I'm gonna put, just cause this, this green line I think is gonna continue to chirp at us. Let's get that train and extra carriage going there. That's gonna pick up quite a bit and it'll continue to pick up quite a bit. Yeah, there we go. It's picking up a lot of those triangles. Uh, we'll need that red line to hurry up. Uh, do I want to shorten the red line? Maybe. I might take it off that circle station there, just so it doesn't have to go all the way up and come back. We'll go ahead and have the yellow line grab that circle as well. Um, we could... I'd really like to get this brown line on a triangle, and you know what? I think we're just going to go ahead and do that. That should reduce the number of triangles I have to wait at that square station just so we can get that brown line involved a little bit more. And it's not, all these trains aren't gonna dump everything, these brown trains dumping everything at that square there, that first square we started with. Another circle spawning out there. We're gonna have our purple line grab that. Yellow line starting to chirp at us, so I think here at the end of the week, um, depending on what things are looking like, I think we'll put an extra train, maybe a carriage on the yellow line um, to help with that. Uh, oof, another circle out there. We will have, let's have the red line pop out and grab that circle there. We'll do a locomotive and we'll do a carriage. And like I said, I'm gonna drop that on the yellow line. And just like that, boom, that should help that out. Brown line is kind of short. I feel like it could do a little bit more, um, but I think we'll leave it for now. I mean, the only other thing I could have it do is maybe hit the plus sign, just so it can help with some of those pluses that are building up at that square as well. That should help out a little bit. Got the spaghetti factory going on here. Quite a bit of mess scattered throughout our lines as we hit 815 people moved. That red line station's coming in there. That's very nice. Um, let's go ahead and break this up there with that circle. Got a star spawning in there. We'll get the red line there and then let's get the green line and we'll go ahead and put the yellow line. We'll just have them all go there. Why not? Get that spaghetti mess really bad there. Uh, and a triangle out there. We'll get the purple line handling that as we reach about 920 people moved. Uh, the Walking Dead games are doing okay on the channel. Not as well as I would like. The first video did really well. The first, yeah, yeah, the first video did really well. Uh, I'd like to see a little bit more, uh, a little bit more response from the audience on those videos. So if you know anyone that might like those videos, please go ahead and share them with some friends. Get them out there. Uh, let everyone know how great they are, uh, and I'll make sure. I'm still going to keep making them, but I might try a couple other games to see if we can get something a little bit uh, a little bit better. We're going to go ahead and drop another train on the red line, I think, as well. 
and that'll start to help with some of the congestion that's building up. And that Green Line station there in the southwest, that one builds up a lot. Uh, we might eventually just drop a interchange on there to just make it a bigger station, I guess. I don't, I don't know. Um, both those stations down there are really getting a little chirpy at us. Uh, and another circle station there. Man, that yellow line station, that one's building up pretty quickly too. Um, we might have to drop an interchange here. Let's go ahead. We'll get the brown line there. Let's see. We're probably going to have to do it. We're going to hold off for a second. Yeah, let's just go ahead and drop that there. Um, I guess we'll just call that a terminal station. I don't know. Uh, that thing spawns quite a bit. This triangle up here, we'll have it grab there and there. Man, this other yellow line station's also... We've got quite a few stations already chirping at us here as we cross 1,200 people. Um, let's pause for a second. We'll get the green line there. And we're just going to have to watch a couple of these. Take the line in the carriage. Um, yellow line, since you are the most noisy, let's get that there. Uh, and then we're going to kind of watch some of these other stations. We've got the brown line, uh, the red line, a couple different spots. Get that there. Um, let's see, what do I want to do? Probably, I think it's going to have to be this brown line there. Let's go ahead and drop that there. A couple different yellow line trains coming in. Is that purple line going to pick anything up? Nope, it, so it might be this red line train unless we pick anything up there and we don't. And I think that's going to be end of the run here. Yep, in 1960 London, 1,347 people moved. I can move that score. Thank you so much for coming out and watching this Tooth and Scrubs video. I really appreciate all the likes, subscribes, everything you guys do. Uh, if you want to get this content on time in an orderly fashion, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. And if not, we'll see you guys in the next one.